Dear friends, greetings from Finland and the Finnish Tank Museum. The Parala Armour Museum parades the achievements of Finnish armoured and anti-tank troops with pride. Soon 60 years old museum has an extensive collection of armoured vehicles, anti-tank weapons and other museum items, not to forget one of the largest armoured trains in the world. We have on display, for example, this iconic Renault FT model 1917 tank. Our collection consists of large number of Russian origin weapons. These Soviet era war monsters are located in these indoor halls as well as under the shelters outdoors. Our speciality is a large collection of Sturmgesuch assault guns. If somebody intends to visit Parola during the summertime, one might be lucky to see some of these old ladies moving around museums so ground. The Parola Armory Museum has a nice bunch of quite rare armored vehicles too. One of those might already be familiar for most of you, namely PT-42, a hybrid tank, Russian origin chassis and English 140 millimeter howitzer as a main gun. All put together by Finns during the wartime with the result which really wasn't the best in the world. But at least the tan tank looks quite sympathetic, doesn't it? I think quite few of you are aware that there was also a kind of sibling tank to BT-42. In March 1943, the armored division made a proposal to general headquarters to modify 20 captured PT tanks into armored personnel carriers. After some bends, armored center was to design this APC and finally got the permission to build a prototype with a wooden platform on top of BT-7 hull. The fighting compartment was also used as a cargo space and covered with hatches. Quite a gadget, which was delivered to assault battalion in October 1943. Obviously, the trials were not very successful as only the pr prototype was built and finally scrapped in May 1945. BT-43 is the one the Parallel Armory Museum has on Santa's wish list. We do understand that it's quite a challenging task for Santa to find a tank like this, but we have very strong trust on his skills. As a matter of fact, this kind of armored sledge could be very useful for Santa when delivering Christmas presents to children in harsh circumstances on Christmas Eve. Well, nevertheless, it would be very nice and we would be very grateful is if Santa would deliver us a photograph of this peculiar tank since we don't have any so far. Only this drawing here can tell us how it looked like roughly 75 years ago. In the meantime, we wish you all Hyvää joulua! Merry Christmas! Please visit our web pages and social media.